Hey everybody, thank you for checking out this video. Today I'm going to be showing you my motivational wall. Um, if you've watched some of my videos, you may have seen it in the background and maybe have been wondering what it is. So I figured I'd go ahead and walk you guys through it. So we're going to start over here at the post-its. And as you can see, there's a bunch of numbers on here. And um, those are the pounds that I want to lose. I have them color-coordinated um, in tens and... Um, when I lose pounds, I get to take a post-it off. So that's just a good way for you to kind of just have a visual every single day of the work that you have ahead of you and also your triumphs from where you started to where you are now. I strongly recommend um, doing this. Maybe even in a notebook, you can just kind of have it written down or on your calendar or something. Or you could also go all out and do this. Um, also, I have jars up there. I don't know if you can see them but they say pounds lost and pounds to lose. And when I lose a pound, I get to move a bead. Moving right along, we have my inspirational note cards. I don't know if you can read all of that, probably not, but a lot of the quotes that I have, um, I took from Instagram and they're posted on my Instagram, all of them. So basically this is just something for me to look at if um, I'm feeling weak or I just need a little pick-me-up and it was really fun to do so um, I strongly suggest it and it definitely is helpful to look over here and see these um, powerful messages and gives me a boost when I'm going to the gym or if I'm having a little trouble staying motivated. So down here, I have um, non-gym days. So these are like little home workouts that I could do. And um, for instance, one is 30 high kicks, 100 squats, 20 push-ups, 20 mountain climbers, and run in place for a minute. And I have like uh, little inspirational things on there as well just to kind of like give me something to do if you know I'm not able to make it to the gym I can still get some work in and um, if I'm bored <laughs> I have something already written out for me to do I haven't actually done any of these yet um, I need to buy a mat because I have hardwood floors and my knees get bruised really easy so anyway down here I have my reward system and um, I need to adjust it a little bit, but kind of just the idea of like every 10 pounds lost, I would give myself a little bit of a reward, and um, I think that that's a good idea, and make sure that you're not rewarding yourself with food, because <laughs> that's going to help you backtrack. Anyway, and then we have my goals of the week, my challenges of the month, and my goals of the week are um, pretty much the same. It's usually lose 10 pounds and then whatever my exercise is. Um, the challenges of the month change though. And I just kind of like figure out what I've done for the previous month and then what I would like to add to it or whatever I want to work on. Or something that I think I can't do but <laughs> show myself that I can. And I just wrote some inspirational things on there as well. And last but not least, I have the top 10 reasons I want to lose weight. Um, I did a full video on this, so if you want to check it out, I'm going to link it down below. And I think that this is probably the most important thing to do when you're on your weight loss journey. Sit there and really think about why you want to lose weight and write it down. Because having that visual is definitely going to help you. And, um, you know, when you have those days where you just kind of want to give up and something else like food or whatever um, seems more important than your goals, you can have it all written there to reassure you that losing weight is really what you want. So I hope that this video helped you guys and hopefully gave you guys some inspiration to do something for yourselves to keep you motivated and I will see you guys all next time. Bye bye.